Baby Spice and uh, Posh Spice here. Sporty? I don't know. <laughs> I feel blinded by the lights. You're about to be blinded by my highlight. <laughs> Do what you love. Let us all be friends. There's no all. Stuck on your boob. But I believe that we all should be friends. Agreed. Hey. Oh, it doesn't feel right. It's been too long. My hair's too, like, narrow. No, 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 no. Hey, guys. What? My hair looks crooked. What? I'm rocking some ins pigtails. Yep. So, today, okay, this was kind of Inspired. a video that we came together with. I'm not saying it's, like, inventive or anything, but we have been noticing and seeing girls in real life with makeup skills and application that far exceed ours. Yes. Obviously, we're not that good at makeup. I would say they're, like, Instagram makeup level, and you see it in real life, and you're like, oh, my gosh. Dude, <laughs> like, that looks not, like, in a mask in a bad way, but, like, a mask in, like, a, it looks like it was created. Completely, perfectly flawless. Like, not a, doesn't seem real. Yeah, it doesn't. It seems digitized. Digitized, yes. 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 Crazy. Okay, so we decided, on that note, we've been dying to get our hands on our makeup and, like, try something different. Like, try that crazy yes. amount of makeup that we've never done before. Yeah, so if you guys like seeing us try things out, test stuff, you know, just have fun with our makeup and see what we come up with, give this video a thumbs up. Let's see if we can get it to 15,000. I think we can. Because... You guys are awesome and I know you can do it. And if you're new here, welcome. You should subscribe. We make videos on pretty regularly. Yeah, if not Two, once times. a week, maybe three times a week. You never, you're always gonna get something. And we also have a vlog channel, TNS, where we are currently vlogging. You can go check that out. And you'll learn about our store, Madison and Mallory, that we have online, which these shirts are from there. She and a stink and love them. But it's like super cute stuff, affordable. There's accessories, shoes, bags sunglasses oh the whole my. thing yes so we're excited to try out some like Instagram trendy makeup things. And if you enjoy stuff like this, go down in the comments, tell us what other types of videos you would like to see and some of your favorite tips for looking digitized and awesome and flawless. Which is not always necessary. I mean, let's be honest. We on the reg do not look that way. So do not wear makeup on the reg. Yeah. Not wearing makeup. I haven't put makeup on all day today, all right? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna do my under eye area, but just as like That's a, so against Instagram trends. But I'm gonna go back and hit it with the norms that they do. But I think this is just good for moisturization purposes. And dear first aid beauty, please whatever is causing them to explode out. This is my last it. it. My last two have done it. I'm just saying. I think it's your makeup bag, hun. No, it's not. <laughs> this is like, I'm on like my fifth one probably. I, I've had a lot of these and I've only had two do this. If we don't mention a product or you miss it, we'll have it linked down below, hopefully, unless we use like about 300 products, which is very likely. And then we could possibly forget one. So just comment below and ask us if it's not there. Booty blender. I'm totally out of primer. But you know, I went back and looked at photos from years ago and I think my under eye area looks improved. Could be all the face tuning. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? I'm so out of primer. That's gonna be a so negative because it's in my liquids bag from when we traveled. I could just open it. Yeah, it's my liquids I could bag. Just, does this not unscrew? I may have to break it. Believe in for so long. There you go, there you go, there you go. Okay, that's, you use that much every time? No, but we're going crazy, aren't we? First thing we're already failing at is perfect lighting. Cause, yeah. I think I'm gonna take my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow because it makes me look like a glowing Instagram goddess. I don't know. I almost got it too. I don't have any of my liquids, apparently. We just got back from traveling, so I think more is more is gonna be the motto of what we're doing today. I'm gonna be using the Maybelline Dream Cushion. Is this new? I think so. Okay, we just got back from New York Maybelline stuff. So we have some products that may not be available yet, but will be available very soon, so. Yeah, like January. Yeah, so this is Maybelline Dream Cushion. Do you know, I have a lot of texture issues like on my virgin my nose, like between my eyebrows. I need to work on that. I have a lot of texture <laughs> issue all over my face. I need to like sandblast it. Yeah, I need to get some stuff done. Work? Not work, but like treatment. Y'all, I can't explain how flawless some of these people People just like. What I've seen lately is foundation, mm -hmm. under eye concealer, uh -huh. eyebrows, uh -huh. bake with the baking under their eyes. You they do their eyeshadow the and they wipe away up. the mess up. Yeah. How do you edit it? How do you edit? All right, I'm gonna use this Kat Von D Lock It Concealer. I'm using Sephora Gel Serum Bright Future in Bavarian Cream. I'm gonna be having Bavarian cream later. In the form of a pizza pie. Yeah, the technique here is just my own. This is a trying video, so. Is it like that? All right, blend. I'm not there yet, because I don't ever do this, so I'm 
slow. Do they put this anywhere else other than under their eyes? Uh, I think it just depends on the person. I wanna do it all. Stephanie informed me that I need to blend fast. Yeah. Okay, you're supposed to do it down the bridge of your nose, over your cheeks, below and above lips. Down here? Um, I don't think so. I mean, I feel like my whole face is white right now. I feel like it doesn't even matter. They brought it all the way down to the tip. Shoot, my phone. I'll just have to bronze it up later. I mean, I'm not. Oh my gosh, I look so big. Now. I kind of dabbed up up there, but. All right. Now we bake. We bake, which is supposed to like, this is Can the. Can I use this? Yeah. This one is the Maybelline. Well, it's, is it light enough? Translucent. Whatever. Um, this is the Maybelline whew, Setting and Perfecting Loose Powder. It's like a white powder. And people say they use this to keep it from creasing, but I find that it does the opposite. Yeah. I feel like it settles into my fine lines. I'm using CoverGirl Translucent Fair 105. I hate using it on my beauty blender. I, know, I feel like it makes do. it moldy. Can I use this thing? Whatever you want to try. Oh, no. Oh, I don't want my phone under this. Oh, I don't want my black pants under this. <laughs> Lean forward. I am. Oh. I don't get this. I don't get this. Not even a tiny little baby bit. Oh, I know I tried this stuff before, kind of, but oh no, this smells like the clean makeup. You know what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. I feel like I feel it drawing in my skin. Uh-huh. It like sucks. Yes. In my okay, yes. good, 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 good. That's not something I've ever felt before. Wonder if I shouldn't have used the skin tone one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh man, y'all. I know, I've seen people do it down here. This is bad. I don't know. It looks yellowy. Go for the white. I've already done. I don't know. I'm gonna just stick it down there, see what it does. Who knows? <laughs> this gotta be bad for your lungs. <laughs> I'm eating it. I'm eating it. Okay. <laughs> good? No, I'm bad. It's stinky. So you let that set. <laughs> Oh, it's on my pants. I feel weird about that. On my pants. I'm not sure about this terminology, but people like to say they're gonna beat their face. What are we so, beating it with? Makeup, so let's beat our eyes with some eyeshadow. Okay, d primer. I know for a fact. Yeah? That people use this primer. I'm using a flat synthetic-y something. I lied. I wanna put this on and then I wanna do my brows. Cause I like to see my brows. When you're doing your eyeshadow? When I'm doing my eyeshadow, but we can put this on, it'll be fine. Okay, I'm using for eyebrows, my most favorite brow pencil right now, the Sephora Retractable Brow Pencil Waterproof Neutral Gray Brown number five. Anastasia Brow is. All right, this is gonna be interesting for me because I've been trying to do my brows different. Yeah. I have a hard time not doing the front of my brows, mainly because, I don't know, I just. I think it's fair. Can we talk about how dirty this mirror is? This is gonna be different because these are Instagram brows. And that fade in the front, but I can't get that fade. I've tried so hard to get I the fade. I don't know how they do the fade. I don't know how they do the fade. Oh, I've got powder in my hair. <laughs> Look how furry my little chin looks down here. You didn't bake that down there. Oh, uh, whoops. Y'all, I can't explain to you how much I am not the type of person to, cause I can shortcut stuff or make stuff not take as long or skip steps. Like I'll skip highlight. You already know that about me. But your face looks so bomb when you have highlight on. I know. Yours, not just everyone, but you're. But I just don't, I don't care that much. If I could wear the same outfit every single day, I would just for saving time and brain power. I don't want to think about it. I mean, it's fun. You should be a nurse or something in the medical field. It's basically what it felt so, like. So when I was in high school and I worked at Logan's, loved it because it was just jeans and a red polo shirt that was like branded for yeah. the company. Yeah. And I don't have to think about it. I don't know. What are they doing? Are they too thick? They're a little crazy. No. How are mine? Good. Those goods are going good. Okay. We're doing it right. I don't know. I just feel like I look more wrinkly and um dried out. Dried out than anyone else. Ah, it's sorcery. It doesn't work. It only works on you. It's like it's not sisterhood of the traveling baking. Okay, moving on. Moving on. Moving on. Yes. I'm using the Carly palette. Hmm. I'm get, I'm going for like a warm orangey red. Yeah, mine's look. a purpley burgundy. Yeah. This is my first lid color here. I think I'm gonna start out in the crease and do this pecan color. It's like that pinky mauve transition color that a lot of people use. Mine's a nice champagne, gorgeous lid color. No matter how much makeup I put on my face, it doesn't show up like theirs. I know, I don't know how they do it. It's, it's sorcery, like you said. Okay, next I'm gonna take a fluffy crease brush. Gosh, my eyebrows are so dark. <laughs> do they look so dark? No, they look normal. Like, no, not your normal, yeah, but like. Yeah, they're real dark. Okay, I'm gonna take this plummy shadow right 
there and kind of do what she's doing with like in the creasy area. Set down a color, but it's just a really pretty like plummy, I guess, pinky plummy color. Also, I feel like I need to use every bit of my eye space, you know? Oh, I'm going up high. I'm taking it, it to the top. Make it big. Stubby brush with a combination of that same crease color and then this dark burgundy color. I'm gonna go crazy and I'm gonna take this rust color and put it on my lid. And I'm gonna do what I've seen people do, which is like they put it like on either side of their lid and then in oh, the and center. Oh, have a color bright in the center. Yeah, because it's like that highlighty like look. I don't know. I'm doing like outer corner action here. I've never used this palette before, so it's definitely like a first impressions. And if it looks uneven, it's definitely the lighting. Because <laughs> we're not, we're great at this. Right? Dazzle shadows, I think they're new. I don't know, it's MAC. This is called Last Dance. I'm gonna go ahead deepen my crease first. I'm gonna take this brown color over here on the outside and stick it under my lash line. All right, I'm gonna take this hickory, dark, dark brown color and deepen my is crease. Is it called hickory? It's called hickory. I was like, oh, that's a way to describe it. Yeah, you didn't know I got good with all my color? Uh-uh. Can somebody just come do my makeup for me, please? I'm gonna try this rose goldy color for a MAC, the Last Dance one in the center of my light and see what it does. Oh. Oh no, 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 no. What is this? And what are you doing on my lid? I'm gonna take this yellowy cream color and stick under my eyebrow like brow bone. Okay, let's try to make you wet. Something I feel like they do that I don't ever try. Okay, I'm gonna take the champagne -y color and put it in it in my tear duct. I can't even talk. I'm gonna have shimmery eye boogers. <laughs> We're getting there. Ooh, I need to use concealer and fix the corners. Yeah. That's a cute face, by the way. I didn't go underneath my lash line. Did you go underneath your lash yeah. line? Yeah. Crap. This is too much makeup. This is way too much makeup. I can't keep up. Rest on the inner corner. Be crazy. Ugh, in my eye and it doesn't feel good. Eggplant. It's like a purpley, like brown. I just want a little bit of purple because I got so much orange. Going crazy, right? Right. I'm gonna be using my physician's formula. Are we dark? All right, I'm using like a tiny travel cap on me. Now, do you feel like we've got to go crazy with this? Kind like of, up real far big wing? Kind of, but not. Oh, I don't know. Mm -hmm. What else do we need? I'm gonna try some inner inner rim liner. This is Sephora Waterproof. I don't think this would do anything. CoverGirl Perfect Point Black Onyx. I don't think I've worn this much makeup. Ever. No, no. we've worn this much before. Maybelline Colossal Big Shot. Ooh. This is also new out in January and we really like it. We're obsessed. I have two tubes in here. I think I do too. Yeah, I do. And I accidentally think I opened both of them, so whoops. Whoops. This stuff's amazing. You guys know that we haven't always said we've loved Maybelline mascara. I have liked the Colossal in the past. Right, and I've liked the oh, Lash Sensational recently. This, this is, it's not too wet, it's not too dry. It's like, it's already like Goldilocks when you first open it. Yeah, I was really loving the Lancome Hypnose Drama and I was gonna get it during the VIB sale. After getting this and playing with it all week, I did not get the Lancome. Can you look at my lashes right now versus? Yeah. It's crazy. I don't even need false lashes between Latisse and this mascara. Hashtag not sponsored by either. I'm gonna put in some lashes really quick. What is this? What is, what's wrong with my head? What's wrong with my head? What is it? I don't know. Now we're gonna contour. Get some sure. color back in these faces. Contour is something I feel like I'm not that bad at. Yeah. Girl, where you at? Girl. There it is. I say, um, you know, go where that is and don't bring it out too far else it becomes beardy. Yeah. You wanna contour under the chin, nose, if I you got want. a couple images to go by. I'm gonna use something else. We're using the Kat Von D palette. Okay. The technique I like to use with this brush, brush. <laughs> like I'll go this way, then I'll turn it this way and like blend, just blend it. Yeah. I don't know 100% sure what the trends are for this. I just know the contouring is. Trendy. Okay, we're supposed to go like up here. I have a big forehead, so I'm all about that forehead contouring. I'm also about calling it contouring. And the temple. We also don't have a good jaw, so this is, this is totally cool with me down here. See that? What is it like? I'm gonna use whatever this is right here. I don't think everyone still does the nose, but I know they highlight it. I feel like I've been putting on makeup for like three hours. Yo. I'm at tired. Least, at least hour, hour and a half. I'm tired of putting on makeup already. <laughs> This one's Fetish by Urban Decay, and it's one that I use a lot. Okay, I'll use it. This is like my everyday color. How's it going? I feel like I have a lot of makeup on. Do you know what the worst part of it is? I still don't feel like I have as much makeup on. We haven't gotten the highlight yet. Okay. 
that. I'm gonna steal your opal real quick. I'm gonna. This is I'm moonstone. gonna sandwich moonstone. I'm gonna um, sandwich some uh, highlights. I also really like the Maybelline strobe stick. I'm not even seeing that on my face. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Look on, look on camera. My bridge. I have so much makeup on right now. <laughs> I feel like this is kind of a nudie color. Matte naked, let's see what happens. I'm gonna exaggerate it. I feel like a lot of people would do this and they would put on like a brownie nude. So let's just try this Kat Von D bow and arrow. Let's see what it do. Like, like normal lip line, exaggerated lip line. Cause we don't have the injections. Yet. Or the naturally full lips. Cause there are some people that do have good lips. Ugh, I love the texture of these. But why do I need lip injections when I can just do that? Get it, dude. Get it, dude. I'm not, I'm not a pro. <laughs> it's hard. Makeup's hard. Makeup's hard. <laughs> and it overdrew my lips like three inches. <laughs> I feel like a grandma who doesn't know where her lip lines are. You know what I mean? How they're just like, yeah, all the grannies are really mm -hmm. mad at us now. Yeah, so, okay, this was us trying to beat our faces like the Instagram girls do and make it look super awesome and like flawless, though I feel like I they're here and we landed somewhere. <gasps> Like, we're just not quite there. Pay for effort. Yeah, maybe practice, but yes. you know what? I would say my combination of concealer and baking, I kind of like. I mean, I have fine lines. That's not something that's gonna go away, but it doesn't feel too cracky. You know what I'm saying? saying I so know what you're saying i would like to say if you guys think we did a good job give this video a thumbs up if you think we did a terrible job give, give this a video thumbs a thumbs up. up because positive reinforcement yeah. um but tell us down below if you want us to do more stuff like this send us sweet comments because makeup yeah and i know sometimes you guys are like you know let's do the same look you don't try anything new and i think fear this, of failure well i think this was trying something new whoa with how much makeup we put on so i feel like my eyes also my work. brows Cause like I can see them. No, they look they're good. Like, they're good. Itch my eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're good. And I feel pretty happy with my brows. Like once everything got on my face and came together, I feel pretty good about my brows. Fierce. Yeah. She so farce. it was fun. We tried something. We hope you enjoyed it. And don't forget that we're vlogging over in T over in yeah, at we're in a world TNS. We're currently trying to move our headquarters. I guess you would call it. That's where all the EG stuff happens. So if you want to come along on that journey with us. Go follow us over there. Don't forget to check out our website and any information on products and stuff will be down below. And we are gonna talk to you guys in another video super soon. With probably less makeup on. Yeah, probably. All right, we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.